Welcome to Bitfumes. I'm your host Sarthak and this video is really crazy. What we are doing, we are just saying we are recording something and that will generate a story for us. Let me show you. Write a story about Iron Man in jungle. Now, you can see whatever I said is now an audio file. This audio file will be converted into story very soon. And here we go. You can see now we have this prompt and we have this story. Obviously, you can say anything about writing a story and it can create that response for you. Now, how we are doing these things and what are the technologies we are using? The real power is in the speech brain model. So this speech brain conversation AI development is really amazing because it's an open source PyTorch toolkit which is used to accelerate the conversation AI development. You can train this model and you can have 40 data sets supporting 20 speech and text processing tasks. Further fine tuning can be done with other models of like whisper llama 2 gpt2 and other hugging face models the best part is you have already trained model and inferences if you go on this hugging face link you will find 120 model already available out of this we have used this one which is conformer transformer lm so I can expand it and this is the one we are using which is having 15 uh, downloads and we can actually sort with most downloaded and the most downloaded one is this one we can use it or this one 44.2k wow amazing so you can use anyone but we are just going to stick with the example one and we will use after this we will use Olama where we have the llama 3 model which is going to generate the story so everything is really great and obviously streamlight is our front end for creating the ui i'm really excited to see how these things is all combined to generate this kind of crazy things for you by the way all the source code is available in the github link in the description and also all these important links will be available in the github repository readme file so if you have any question just hit me in the comment section and don't forget to hit subscribe button because this is the real thing you can do for me and if you like this video obviously that's going to motivate me to create more content like this so without wasting time let's get started to get started First, we are going to create the Streamlit application. Then we will see how we can record something and get the WAV file. And finally, we will use this Spreech Brain to convert that audio file into the text. So let's see. So first of all, here I am on this and I'm going to first of all create a virtual environment. And once this is done, I'm going to activate this starting with the streamlit and creating the app.py file okay so from streamlit uh, i can say import streamlit as st st dot title is a speech brain um a speech to text okay Let's start this. So streamlit run application. And once it's running, here we have. So what next? Once we have this streamlit, we want a package for a streamlit, which will be helpful to record the audio on our streamlit application. And this is the package we are going to use called streamlit audio recorder. You will find all the links in the github repository or github repository link is in the description okay so how to get started with this we need to run this pip install streamlit audio recorder so let's install this right here once this is done we need to use it how we can use it 
it's very easy we say import audio recorder from audio recorder and then create a new instance of audio recorder so let's see we say from audio recorder import audio recorder and then i'm going to say recorder is equal to audio recorder and first what will be the um, name for the button which we are going to have here so right now uh, it's doing something and you can see now we have the record button once we click on the record button it's going to record whatever i am saying and once you stop this recording then it should return you recording audio but how do we get that so first we get the audio here and if the length of the audio is greater than that means we have the audio then we can start using that audio into our streamlit application okay so i say audio if length of audio is greater than zero then streamlit dot audio and here i will provide the audio dot export dot read and this is the thing we have done so let's restart and recording is in progress let's stop it here we got it and let's listen is in progress wow so that's really working super duper easy and you know what in this there is a autoplay attribute so we can add it and call it true so once done it will automatically start so i'm going to hit the record button and now what am i'm saying it's recording hit stop i'm going to hit the record button and now what am i'm saying it's recording hit see how easy this is but we also want to store this file into mp3 or wave basically an audio file how we can do that once again this library is useful and we just need to export it like this so simple let's export it and once done then we can see that audio.wave file will be here so let's try once again reload recording and now once we stop this will be available in our explorer so recording that's good but here you can see we have the audio file and recording and now once we stop. okay so now once we have these things then we are ready to convert this audio.wave file into the text so for this i'm going to use the speech brain it's an open source conversational ai model and let's go to the github and here it says how we can get started okay yeah so pip install speech brain we can get that and we say hey pip install speech brain once this is done then you can use it something like this so we have the pre-trained model which we can use and here we can first copy and paste and what i'm going to do i'm going to actually create a simple function which will be like uh, convert a speech to text and inside this i will paste all these things okay so import will come at the top and here we have the encoder decoder asr from speech brain interference and then we create the instance by providing the source of the model and we are storing the model in our local directory which we will be getting once we run this file so there will be a pre-trained model directory here where the model will be stored and finally once we have the model then we can simply say transcribe the file and the file is going to be the audio.wav file which we have here in our local file explorer okay once this is done then we will be able to get the text i can say and simply i'm going to return the text okay and at the last i'm going to say convert speech to text 
and maybe I can say here instead of uh, there and I will provide I'll provide nothing because it will going to get this wave file directly okay so this is good but let's see is this going to work or not so as soon as I reload this is going to run this Python file and now it says that hey you need the torch vision which is not available also you need the torch audio for this once you have all these things then you can go ahead also there is uh, saying that please use backend keyword kind of things we will tackle each and everything and first install uh, torch vision and torch audio torch audio okay so once these two are done then we can start our application so let's see uh, we have some error once again and it says a lot of things basically could not find a backend to handle the uri so to solve this issue we need to install a very simple library called py sound file py sound file and once done then we can start our application and yes we are ready to go there are some warning we are going to ignore these warning because it will going to work very fine before doing anything i'm going to just get the uh, i can say transcript is equal to this and i say streamlit dot markdown of transcript so we will see the transcript here once we have done so let's reload once again and say hey how are you so let's record hey, stop <laughs> so it's sometimes bad to real listen to yourself while this is running that means it's doing some kind of thing and if it is successful then yes you can see it says hey how are you and with some different word which i cannot recognize so let's try it once again i am good how are you Now this should be there in our streamlit and good. I'm good. How are you? So this is the way you can convert whatever you say directly to the uh, to the text. And once you have the text, then what you can do? Obviously, you can use Olama, OpenAI, or any LLM model to turn it into something else. So I'm going to write a story. For that, I'll need the Olama. So I'll say pip install Olama. And once we have the Olama, so simply say import Olama. And then I will say create a function called uh, generate story. And I'll say story uh, description description of this generate story from this question okay so i need the lm and for that i'll say olama dot olama and then i'll need to define the model or oh, basically i need to say chat and here we define the model as llama 3 and make sure you already have the olama install in your local and obviously pulled the llama 3 model and if you want to use the open ai that's also fine for me okay so this is good and then we provide the messages messages is going to be something like this where we provide the role as uh, let's say user and then maybe i can say system and the content is like you are best story teller story uh, writer and you can write a brief story from the question given by user okay after this i'm going to say hey there is a role of now comes the user role and then comes the content as the question we provide okay 
So this will actually return you the response. And once you have the response, you can simply return response. And here we get the content. And let's go here. On this, I'm going to, obviously we have this transcript we get. And then we say, generate a story from transcript. And we get the story. And let's say, streamlit markdown of story so this is going to be crazy and one thing more and i need to hear say this is first message and then content okay let's try and start by saying uh write me a story okay write a story about iron man in jungle wow that's really amazing and see it's now running that means first it's converting using a speech brain from this wave file to the text. Using that text, we will actually going to create a prompt for our Olama. And now you will see it's generated the text and it's moved into the Olama model, which is going to write a story for us. So write writer's story about Arnold man. <laughs> You see, this is Arnold man in jungle. I, I have not seen this kind of amazing and funny things. By the way, here we have the story. What an intuitive prompt. Here is the brief story I can come up with. The jungle of unending dream. Arnold, a rugged adventure. <laughs> so this is how it works and it's super duper crazy. If you have a really amazing GPU compute power, this is going to be super duper fast. I hope you like this video and if you have any question related to this video, comment section is always open for you. And don't forget to hit subscribe button which is very very important for me. Hit that subscribe button and also hit that like button, smash that like button because that gives me motivation. The number of likes give me motivation to create more content just like this. See you in the next video. Till then, goodbye.